news, we go to the Redskins and the Cardinals. Terry Robiski hoping to win one game in his three-game run. As head coach, that's Champ Bailey on offense. So he, does he get it? Yes, it's his first offensive touchdown. Champ Bailey catching the ball against Arizona with a big 20 to nothing lead. Catching the pass from Brad Johnson. Deion Sanders says, you know, I used to do that, but right now I'm just cold. <laughs> Tommy, what happened to Jake Plummer? What, what's happened to him? You know, they made such an investment in Jake Plummer and have not gotten the production from him. It, it, it's just been amazing how his talents fell off once he got the money. And yeah. Bruce Smith going and get a sack. And I, I, you know, Bruce Smith, what a player he has been throughout his career. 13 seasons of 10 or more sacks for Bruce. And you know what they do? Now, Terry Rubisky's a good guy. I may not keep this job, but they, they, they dumped a the Gatorade on him, which... Gotta get out with a little bit of shampoo there, I guess. And Washington wins it 100 yard day for Stephen Davis, 20 to 3 over Arizona. Well, will that one victory by Terry Robiski be enough to at least make Daniel Snyder think about keeping him on as head coach? And Arizona ends up losing seven straight. Dave McGinnis, uh, one and eight as head coach. After the game, Terry Robiski informed the team that a man who played for the Redskins a long time through last year, 38 year old Dan Turk, whose condition was, was concealed and kept private by his family passed away last night in his battle for cancer. He leaves a wife and a young daughter, and it's a reminder at this Christmas time to be thankful for what you and we may have, and our condolences go out at this time to the Turk family.